revoke all token, what will happen? Uh, this you want to revoke, revoke all addresses or avoid or disconnect all addresses. What you will the beef dot finance? If you want to revoke, to revoke all addresses that are connected or you have granted them permission to your wallet, you will have to provide some fee. So the, there is a fee that you need to pay. So for for example here, I will have to pay interacting with the beef dot finance to be able to revoke all addresses that are connect your wallet the first thing that we do you have to type the beef.finance as i showed then the second one is that you can revoke uh, addresses that are connected to your ethereum also to your smart chain so if i select your smart chain it will show me uh, different addresses that are directly connected to my wallet and i've granted them permission that means they can still uh, take my, my my tokens in my wallet now to be able to allow the beef to finance to revoke all addresses there are some fee that you, you have to pay there is a fee you have to pay some dollar you have to pay so for example if i want to revoke all i'll click here revoke all that means i'm disconnecting i'm avoiding these addresses to 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 be accessing my wallet directly so here it will open open so i'll have to pay 0 0.06 so if i grant them approve that means i'm invoking those i'm invoking uh, those addresses that are accessing my my wallet uh, and i've granted them permission during uh, staking or providing liquidity or during swapping from one token to another so this is the process of revoking you just mean this means you are disconnecting your wallet to other addresses the second method is disconnection process it's advised that when you are using the dab for example i'm using pancake swap once you finish exchanging or swapping from one token to another if you are connected for example if you are connected your wallet with the pancake swap or other decentralized exchange once you finish swapping it's advised to to log out so i'll come here on you click on your address here then log out so log out so if you want to swap next time you have to log in you have to log in or connect your wallet so it's advised to disconnect once you finish your swapping if you want to swap you have to connect it so thanks for watching my videos don't forget to share and don't forget to subscribe thanks